Um, na, yeah. Na, 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 na. <laughs> just there humming along. <laughs> it's, it's just on. Te it's, you've got the YouTube video of ten hour, ten hour <laughs> um, survivor. Of course. Yeah, so we um, you get four hours into it, and you get a proximity alarm and a com message. Do you pause uh, Survivor first of all? Uh, of course. Hey, not. hey, Let's Rory, play you're a fucking liar. There is no ten-hour version. <laughs> well, I'll make it. All right. Damn it! In the year three thousand two hundred, someone's Damn made it, a ten-hour version. Right. Of course, I don't um, don't pause it. Is yeah. It okay. So is, is it another audio? Thing. Yeah, it's like a it's yeah, so like a connection. The guy in the background can hear that song going on. Yeah, so the Skype opens up and and the guy you can just hear him start tapping his foot along to a survival. Oh, it's, it's like I'm this like, is oh, you this enjoy, is you enjoy the song too. This is classic song. I like. Yeah, so it's it's the uh, Omnitech system ship and it's. Oh, is he British? No, no, he's Russian. Perfect. Let me get his shit. His name is oh god, how am I gonna ever pronounce Sergei that shit? Putkin. Kolorov Mik Mikhovich Mikovich. Kolorov Mikovich. I used a Russian name generator and it didn't it wasn't very kind to me. Perfect. Anyway, no. <laughs> Carry on. Yeah, so uh Kolorov Mikovich and he identifies himself as the captain of Piskov's light. Uh, would you like to speak to our captain, or will I do? Amirov Mikovic? Uh, yeah. That's, that sounds right. No, I, I say to him, uh, would you like the captain, or will I do? I, he's like, I would like to speak to captain. Uh, I, I leave my room. Oh, God. My computer room. Uh, would, would I know where our captain is? Or yeah, yeah, you've all been on the ship for a while. I'm imagining, okay. apart from maybe. I, so okay, so I open, I open the door. Uh, I don't, don't walk in because obviously stupid shit's happening in here. So I just open the door without looking at him and say, "Hey, the ship wants to talk to you. Are you want to come to my room?" No. <laughs> Why not? I mean, they're gonna kill us. There, there is the box running around. I'm not gonna take the risk of dying. Hey, it's next door. And I'm still more safe here than in your room. Can I transfer the message and things? To yeah, yeah, definitely. I, yeah. <laughs> so I just wanted to let this play out. Transfer the whole thing to both of our compads so I can hear as well as him. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, he uh, identifies yeah, himself. Yeah, my Hello. How are you doing this fine day? Oh god, I can't do Russian accent. It's like, I, I am good. Have you got package? We had the package. And now the package is somewhere around the ship. I am not exactly sure where it is. It is fine. We will uh, identify with ID tag. And then, uh, Jordan, you get like a... Like a... Um, a sort of like pop-up window that's like, accept scan of ship uh yeah totally yeah okay so they scan the ship we're not hiding anything and um they're like uh we have found box we will send marines to us to uh we will send yuri and marines to receive box and bring your payment um mind telling me what is inside the box sensitive material well, I know it's a uh, it's something probably infected with the virus we found in in the lab. The character face palms. <laughs> okay, so there's like a silence for like thirty seconds, and it's like it is a uh, it is mistake by company. We oh, are fair, fair enough. Um. I'll I'll return the the tubes of the virus to you as well. Um. So no no more mistakes, my friend. Yeah, he's like um. I don't even know what that was. Uh, he's like um. It's good if you could uh, assemble all crew and materials at uh, loading bay. All right, all right, I will. 
Uh, by the way, I accidentally uh, killed the material inside one of the tubes. That is fine, it is for disposal. Yeah, it, it apparently dies if you blast it with electricity. I th- Ah, oh, I did not know that! <laughs> I'm stupid. <laughs> stupid Russian man. No, he's like, uh, yes, we have trained team. They know lots of science stuff. <laughs> yeah, so, um, basically they launch a cargo lighter. Oh, fair enough. Um, goes I open the door and I'll, I'll pay <laughs> You tell us that they're coming. Yeah, yeah, like you don't know. Oh, I would fucking broadcast it. Like I don't fucking care. Yeah, like I'm assuming everything, unless you specifically say. Yeah, I'm just gonna fucking broadcast it. Yeah, like everything goes over the whole network. You can. Yeah. Unless you specifically like encrypt it somehow. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna take all but one of the the needles. Yeah, yeah. So you're gonna keep one and. Give everything else back. Do you uh, keep the mini fridge? <laughs> uh, I'm gonna take it with me. Yeah. Okay. I immediately take it out of your hands. And it's like, oh. I, can I take that? I am computer nerd. I need mini fridge next to a computer. I don't. I don't need to leave for drinks. Yeah. <laughs> I know it all too well. Like pretty much, I'll I'll take it there, and then I'm going to ask them. If... <laughs> Why the fuck did you put a mini fridge inside a big fridge? <laughs> yeah, I'm also going to ask about that. Because that's fucking retarded. Yeah, so, um... Okay, no. uh, on hearing the con- obviously because I'm with him, hearing the conversation... Also, I'll like, if it would have been Coke Zero, uh, I will just take the, the Coke as well, because, like, I would have not opened it. Yeah, yeah, you, nobody wants that shit. I love that shit. I have a can of oh, fucking, I'll That's... Take it to them. Like, this is all... <laughs> yeah, so next week we're going to be using you know... four members, not five. <laughs> yeah, well, um... I'll just... When they're there, I'm just also going to tell them that this was a mistake by the company. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're like, that guy That guy was uh, caught, courted, drawn and courted. Uh, this is fucking funny. But yeah... Uh, I'll go there and wait for the guys to come in. Okay, what uh, about everyone else? I go across I, I head, the I head wall. straight to the cargo bay. Yeah. Um, bef- Iblis would open a private channel to uh, Elise and ask her to run a scan on the incoming vessel just to see. It was already on it, <laughs> obviously. Hmm? Yeah, so if I, if I was to scan that ship, how many people, life forms, things? What do I find? Do I get a private message? Uh, no. Uh, I was doing a Google search or something. On syringe guns? <laughs> yeah, of so course. you're scanning their ship. Yeah. yeah. Are you gonna? Are you trying to do this discreetly or are you just literally just... Uh, I, I, in fact, no. Uh, have they completely hung up on comms? Uh, well, it's like a, you can just like, Calm them back easily enough. Uh, so I, I sent them a message saying, uh, "Mind if I scan your ship? Security, of course." Ah, uh, yeah, they they say that's fine and allow you to 100% scan. Hundred scan their ship. Yeah. Uh, I scan the ship. What do? Uh, let me get their sheet. Right. So it is a frigate. Okay. So it is battle class. Yeah, yeah. It's um, it's like um. Too big to land easily on a. It's made for space combat, basically. There's no, like. So it's a patrol boat? No, no, it's a frigate. Oh, okay. frigate. It's in battle. Pretty much. Yeah, like. like frigates were a class of size, but whatever, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. No, they're, they're a yeah, but it, it's a. Yeah, it's a small battleship. Um, it has enough space for maybe. There's 40 life signs on it. Okay. Um, and how many are incoming? Five. Um, I, I relay the information about how it's a battle standard ship, and uh, there's like probably uh, 30 plus people. It has them. two plasma beans and a flak battery. And also if their weapons are way more advanced than ours. And it also has some sort of uh, shield defense system. And they have defense and like us. So, A, they're a big company we really don't want to piss off, so let's not. 
and B, if you do, we're dead. Yeah, they'd fuck, they'd fuck you up. Indeed. I finished what I said. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, I, I uh, do this, uh, put everything on pause. Uh, oh, so you you, you stop playing the Survivor. Yeah. <laughs> the song into my compad and Karen walking into the... So do you have, like, a pair of Beats plugged into your compad? Oh, no, Beats for stupid people. I know. Just, just, oh, bugs. <laughs> just normal normal earphones, like £5 from Curry's. Oh, no, even, even worse. You know the earpieces? No, I like, don't. Like the 50p ones you find. Uh, oh, okay, shop. yeah. This is, this is, I'm going to jot that down. It's very important information. Perfect. <laughs> right, yeah, so um, does everyone assemble? Uh, I go across, knock on Lars's door, and ask him to help me carry the box to the cargo bay. Okay, cool. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly what I expected. <laughs> yeah, I know. I, I, got, I got a message telling me that. I was like, hmm, hmm, <laughs> walking box. It, it was fun. It like wasted like an hour of the session that I haven't planned for, so it's fine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. So everyone meets down. Vele, you like you, you're first there, and you turn around, and just Joe and Lars walk in with the box. Okay. Um. Then it, yeah, everyone's also, there. Also, like the first thing I say is, "You fucking dicks! I needed the fucking experiment on that thing." I just found it. It was. Back of the cargo bay, you didn't look very well. Fucking liar. <laughs> don't don't worry. I'll have my plans for you. Okay, oh, so actually now that I think about this it's stupid. You're all by the airlock. And they because it's a cargo lighter, they wouldn't you couldn't just drop the ramp of them like fly in. So they like dock to the side of your ship, it's just a small shuttle. And um the doors open. Some guy in like strict um like naval space naval uniform walks in all like up straight backed with his hands behind his back and he's got two marines shouldered either side of him in like full tactical armor and laser rifles i look up to him and say the one with the amazing uniform and say yuri i presume he's like yes i'm yuri Yuri, Yuri Gagori. Gregory? No, Gagori. I don't know if anyone knows. It's just like, yes, I'm Yuri. And then he introduced himself. He's like a first mate of Puskov's Light, um, Chief Gunnery Officer, stuff like that. I was just, just making sure, sir. I so sure I, I'm, the same I'm pretty much in hazard suit at this point. Yeah. <laughs> because, you know. Yeah, yeah you're still in your. You're still, like, got your gloves on and. Got a stethoscope for some reason. <laughs> uh, also, I would have like a, a box for the needles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've you've like arranged all of it in. And the needles thing. are in the mini fridge. No, oh, fuck that. I want to do that. <laughs> Jordan, did you actually take the mini fridge? By the way. I want to take the no, mini fridge. No, no. I'm like I'm pretty much. First, I'm gonna. You know. Okay. That. So as soon as he works in, you're like he, he introduced himself. And he looks, he looks at your at Ville and he's like, "What the fuck is small fridge? <laughs> what is madness?" Uh, and you uh, hear one of the marines behind chuckle. The one of the marines behind the... chuckles, and then he like looks at him like, "Fucking sort your discipline out." You 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 wanted everything, so here's everything, and I hand, I hand him the the needles. Okay, he just stands over his hands behind his box and one of the marines walks forward and takes everything off you and then just like puts so, the mini fridge on the floor and walks back. I, I, so you don't I, want I, the I, mini I, fridge or the coke inside? <laughs> He's like, what is coke? What coke is? I, I, uh, I, I open the mini fridge and I hand him the coke uh, and I say, this is also a mistake by our company. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't like, his, his hands are still behind his back. He's like, I, I do not want uh, coke. I, I tentatively walk up to the... Uh, the Fair enough. I walk up, pick up the mini fridge, put the coke inside. Yeah, and, and back. then walk back, yeah. <laughs> it's like um, remote powered as well, so it's still like nicely, Perfect. nicely cool. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> I open the coke and down it. Yeah. Okay, so have you gone back to the computer room? 
no, no, I'm still standing. Okay, you're still there. Waiting until the inspection. Yeah, finished. they they basically say, um, he says, uh, you'll come back to ship for payment. All right. Uh, I notion over to uh, Rio that he should uh, follow him just in case. Okay, so he basically invites all of you to come. Whoever <laughs> goes is up to you. Screw yeah. <laughs> I say, if you don't mind, I'm going to go back to my room and just start to walk away. Does he stop me? No, no, he's like, um, he's like, yes, of course, ship must be manned. Sorry, I just head back to the computer room. Yeah. Down in my coke. Okay, so who stays and who goes? Pilot, Pilot stays. I go. Okay, you go. What about warriors? I'm going to go. Yep, Joe? Lars is going, I'm gonna stay. Okay, cool. So yeah, you get <laughs> You get on the uh shuttle it like So it So pretty much three people instantly die when our ship gets nuked. Um Or maybe we get two campaigns and it's just you and Lars on that ship and then I I run a separate one for free, Joe and Jordan. <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah, no. Yeah, so you just disconnect and um like go back over to Peskov's light and so dock kind of and it Say that again. What kind of guns uh, are Uh like laser rifles. Okay. They're like proper decked out. Okay, they're space marines. Well, would you say that their stuff is don't fuck with us stuff? Oh yeah, definitely. Or would it be? You can fuck with us, but you're gonna die. So I point at one of the guys with the laser rifle and I ask, so you compensate for something? He says, um, he's like, big gun, big penis. <laughs> <laughs> no, he just, he just looks at you <laughs> and then, and then goes back to what he was doing just straight. They're all stood up like at attention with their rifles in both hands. I just sit comfortably. Yeah. So it, it takes like a couple of minutes to just dock back on the thing. And um <laughs> Yeah, so um they basically dock and then they lead you they lead you to the bridge. Lars and Ville. And yep. um, oh. as you walk through the ship, you, you notice there's like quite a lot of these marines. And it's a very big ship. And you're like, yeah, it's a good job we didn't fight. Basically. So you get to the bridge. And... Kolorov is stood there in the middle. And like either side of him is just two briefcases. And as soon as you walk in, and uh, you just, like Yuri nods to him, and two just like deck hands bring you the case, and there's like seven thousand five hundred credit chips in each one. Right. It's like a here was payment. Um, mind I suggesting something? Yes. There was quite a bit of shit back at back at the lab. You might want to nuke it from orbit. He like if you can. He like points out out of the uh, front viewing window, and you just see a couple of like missiles fly off. It's like I guess it, that's taken care it, of. Then it is already in progress. Fair enough. Well then, everything is worked out. Thank you for the payment. Okay. Um. He says. Uh, oh no! You already told him you opened the box, didn't you? Okay. I didn't open the box. No, no, the box was. No, oh no, that you you know about the virus, basically. Yeah, yeah. He says, um, did you encounter uh, any more mistakes on planet? We did, and we also encountered three British ships from another company. They they came in, they shot some, and they That's said the same they. In fact, they're the exact same ships. No, they're Panstella company. They're a different company. Oh, okay, my bad. Then I'm being an idiot. Um, he's like, what ships? Uh, we we detect no ships in orbit. Are they have they left planet? I I I think they either left or they landed. They are Panstellar ships. 
as soon as you say Panstella, he like turns around and runs over like well runs he like brisk pastes over to the uh scanning computer he's like i want full full uh planet scan you'll find ships you destroy and then the guy just starts typing away and we flip back over to freed jordan and joe freed are you in pilot seat yep jordan are you in computer room yeah Joe, you whereabouts are you? Uh, I'm probably, if it's not unlocked, checking the lab to make sure he hasn't left anything. Like, should destroy. Okay, one second. Yeah. We should destroy everything. Why have we got boom written on one of our rooms? It's the explosive storage, bro. Okay. Soon to be, anyway. Yeah. No, it has a, the empty husk of a missile in it. Yeah, yeah, but it will soon be more than one missile. It will be thousands of missiles. It's it's and not think... that big of a room, but yeah. Yeah, but think think about how many I can... Hey, just... he's a Russian. He's going to be good at Tetris. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, man, and think about it. Why like, if Russians one missile is 50, then I can buy, like, a billion missiles with fucking 15. Yeah, days. but these are, like... Small scale anti tank missiles. They're not like. Who the fuck cares? You can jury rig all kinds of explosives. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like you can jury rig grenades, you know. Kind because of shit. I think it's as useful in space combat as IEDs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> exactly. And there's just I like just... there's just like a bit of trash floating in the air with a blinking light on top of it. <laughs> yeah. And nobody, nobody pays attention, and then it violently. Explodes. Yeah, and then it just hits the hole, and it's just like boom. <laughs> yeah. And every time it happens, Villa's in the uh, in his room, in his glass box, like just making a boom sign. Boom, boom. Yeah, it's like the, no, no. I'm like I have some kind of magnetic boots, and I'm like at the ramp, uh, and I have like. Damn, you haven't played Team Fortress, but there is a guy that is pretty much a demolitions expert and he has like a small thing on his belt that is on his crotch and then he lifts it and there is like a smiley face and he says boom, that's his taunt. That's pretty much what I'm doing. By the way, he's a black Irish cyclops. Yeah. I could understand. Yeah. It's so fucking dumb. <laughs> Demo man is so dumb. But you know. EF2 is so dumb. Boom. Boom. The best. Yeah, so, um, <laughs> where were we? Oh, yeah, um, we flipped back to Joe. Whereabouts are you in the ship? He said he was in the lab. He's in the lab. Okay. Yeah. Are you doing anything specific in the lab? Uh, I'm searching to see if there's anything. He's, like, smuggled anything so I can destroy him. Okay, um, well, since you said that out loud, Ville, whereabouts did you leave the one syringe? Like, oh, is it on your body? Like yeah, yeah. But is it in the lab or is it? Uh, it would probably be in like either a safe in the lab where I would keep my my important stuff. Like I wouldn't keep it in my quarters. Fuck that. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so Joe, give me a perception check using wisdom. Uh, so it's gonna be minus one. Or you know, it would be just hidden in places. Yeah. I'm going to say it's just hidden because, yeah. Um, yeah, I can't You right search right. about for a bit, but you find some, like... Um, Another mini fridge. Yeah. <laughs> you, you find the empty test tubes. Yeah, you find some, like, indiscriminate science shit and maybe, like, a, a Russian girl's in bikini swimsuit. Um, specialist... Um, Test tube magazine or what, whatever. Just indiscriminate <laughs> stuff. Why is that in the lab? What samples are you taking? <laughs> <laughs> oh, so not the point, but I like it. <laughs> Alright, in that case I'll just leave, go back to my room. Yeah, okay, so, um, well, basically, um, Jordan and Freed at the same time, you're your consoles light up with proximity alerts and there's ships coming up from the planet. Uh, okay. Assuming Freed already knows this because he'd be the only other person with a computer. Yeah. 
uh, I wouldn't contact him. I'd contact uh, the captain and say, um, there's ships coming. Probably the ones off that planet. Okay, so at the same time, over on the Russian bridge, uh, there's like, they're going to battle stations, basically, and they're like, incoming ships. Um, yeah, Dave's not here that there are ships coming up. Um, I just message, or I don't message you. Uh, no, I, 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 I just tell you there are ships coming go, up. If you go to the fucking laser and shoot those bitches. Uh, um, well, um, okay, well, they're, um, they are, there is a bulk freighter and two patrol boats. Who the fuck cares? Um, Iblis would Going. pipe in and say, Yes, we work, we work for, we work for the moment, for, uh, what the fuck is their name? Uh, Omnitech Megacorp. Omnitech Megacorp, but do we really want to make enemies of Panstellar? Yeah, I would suggest we remain neutral in that case. Uh, you, I would say if we don't shoot them, we might anger the the bigger fish. We should worry about that this time. Okay, so um, the captain of the ship um, hears you saying this, and he's like, "Oh, he's like, oh, uh, uh, our company's it's not known, but we are not friendly. They we they are trying to take over our business." They are trying to take well, exactly this secretive. What I was guessing. Also, I'm guessing if we kill them, they are not gonna tell anybody that we killed them. Uh yes, dead people do not communicate. Well, exactly. Uh, I, well, dead, the dead, ones on the planet do, but that's a different story. Different story. Dead, dead men tell no tales, you know. Okay, yeah. That's so he's like, uh, we will fight. Um, you take box to headquarters. Will you do this? There'll be more money for you. Fair enough, that sounds like a good plan. Okay, uh, so he's like, um, he says, he basically says... Should I take the needles as well, or you keep the needles? Uh, he's just like, take the box, and he says, if you get to the cargo lighter, um, it'll take you back to your ship, and... Okay, yeah, yeah, we go. I speak, I look at... And I obviously, the like, the first thing I do is I fucking grab the briefcases. Yeah, yeah I'm assuming, like... I know the box is okay. So the box is at the airlock where you came in, and you're on the bridge, and he tells you to take it with you, and so you just tooth it with the boxes. Yeah, and I I, I just grab the briefcases. Yeah. But because of rolls, would I be able to would I be able to um using their computer uh, talk to them? Talk to who? The people near the ship. Yeah, yeah, you, you've you've got an open comm network from when you oh, yeah. asked to scan their ship. Uh, I I ask them, um, well, anything bad if we were just to leave and get this ASAP to the uh, drop? Uh, they say literally to you like, that's what exactly what we want you to do. We want you to get this cargo, make sure. That's perfect. Because before know. Ville interrupted him, he was basically trying to say that um, <laughs> they're trying to take, because they they produce pharmaceuticals. They're trying to make this disease go go like system wide so that they can then cure it and basically take over the whole system okay and, so, uh, but it's a bit like cloak this. and dagger uh hearing yeah. so thinking that it's just me and him listening uh me and him communicating uh i say uh thank you captain uh see you on the other side yeah uh, turn uh end communications and say to uh bridge character uh iblis we are leaving yeah. He, he pilots the ship to intercept the uh, transport stuff so we can get away even faster. Yeah, so basically you um, you close in to like Lamprey Lock with the um, the friendly Russian ship. Yeah. Yeah, that works for me. Uh, before we leave, I would ask the officer what exactly would be the pay. Uh, 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 he's like a uh, <laughs> big money. You just need to take it to uh, Omnitech home base uh, in Peskov. In Arabic numbers. It's like uh, hundreds of thousands. Well, sounds good enough. You're just like, okay. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I don't want to get shot. <laughs> yeah, like the, the bridge is sort of like in ordered chaos now. Like, oh, shit's 
static and all the panels just explode with. Yeah, like the the ship like shakes. There's a bit of smoke. Some guy flies across the room. No. <laughs> yeah. So basically, okay. the weapons start firing, and um, oh, this is kind of awkward how to explain because you're in space, so there's no like. Basically, your two ships are level, and coming up from the planet is the uh, the other ships. So you're not in between the Russian ship and the uh, um, British ship. You're sort of off to the side, so you're not in the line of fire, really. Okay. So yeah, um, like the battle starts, and the bulk freighter just like. Um, books it away from the battle and the two patrol boats like close in and there is some fire I, I shouldn't really roll for all this shit because then it just becomes like me playing this game <laughs> don't worry you don't have to roll well, we'd like just, to... tell us, just tell us who wins we'll run <laughs> no, like, Iblis will try and book it as soon as they're on our ship yeah, yeah well that, they, that's, yeah, that's not going to be so easy yeah, so just 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 say who wins. No, well, like, uh, you can just roll only 20s. That's no problem. Fucking roll them. Roll them. Roll, roll, roll a d20. The person, uh, odd, we win. Uh, even, they win. They oh, no, no. I know what happens. I'm just saying, like, I'm not going to roll it all out, like, turn by turn. No. Just, just tell us uh, what happens. Then. Yeah. Okay, so we skip all ahead. You're both boarded. There's, like, hundreds of marines and, like, 20 <laughs> zombies. <laughs> no, yeah, so, um... Basically, as you're running towards the, um, the the airlock, mm. um, the the Russian ship just starts like moving off from where you're, um, next to it, freed, and they mm -hmm. just basically start going into battle. So, do you want to like tag, like sort of stay in a? I think it's called a lamprey lock. Lamprey lock, yeah. No. Uh, disengage as soon as possible and start like getting out of the sector. Okay, yeah, but then the the other guys are still on the ship. That's what I'm saying. Oh, okay, yeah. The, then waiting for them to yeah. get on and then doing that. Okay, so basically the patrol boats are gonna close and then try and board you. As in, uh... can, I, can I make a check to see if I can keep our airlock shut? Oh, they've got oh, boarding they... tubes. Oh, fuck boarding tubes. Well, based, like, uh, weren't the other ones, just the guys on the other, like, the Russian ship just gonna get on over to ours? Yeah, but we're talking, like, they're not gonna make it at the same time. Okay. So, you can either stay here and, like, try and fight off, or, like, GTFO and come back later, or it's up to you, basically. Well, we would need to wait for the cargo, so he just fucking wait, I assume. Yeah, okay, so the, the ships basically aren't going to fire at you, and they're going to, like, get into close quarters and board. Sure. Can you just strafe away from them? <laughs> well, that's like, what I'm asking, would... like... Yeah, why, why don't we just strafe away from them? Instead of running, we just strafe away so they can't board. Sure. <laughs> Like evasive maneuvers then to not be boarded, but still staying close by enough so they can get on the like small cargo ship and get over to us. No, the small like transporter ship, shuttle. Mm, just looking. I think they're faster than you. Shit. <laughs> well, I have an awesome ass. No. <laughs> well, I've got this secret we have a, we NOS have a button. Yeah, they got a speed of four. Oh. Well, wouldn't they need to lamp relock to actually board? Yeah. Like, I'm not saying they have boarded you, I'm saying they... Yeah, yeah, yeah. they're gonna want to. Yeah. Okay. So, are you gonna... St no. The other question is, are you gonna start firing? I'm not gonna be firing, because I'm piloting the ship. Yeah, well, it's general. Else. I'm talking to the room. Uh, yeah, I'll run over to the cons. Yeah, I'll run to the guns still. No, okay. I don't think you should. If we're going to get boarded, it's not wise. Yeah, but if we get boarded and we're dead anyway, because there's going to be like 30 of the fuckers. I don't know, you can keep them in a... Uh... You can funnel what, them what in. What spike drive level do we have? 
Um, one. Oh. They have two. Can we just phase out this existence so that both things doesn't work? Yeah, technically we can. I don't know how I don't know how that works against boarding, but if they lamp lock with us, I think we're locked to the same uh, spike level, so to speak. Yeah, basically. Yeah, so I'm just we're... getting to that page now. I'm just trying to. It's on page 68. 68. No, 67. 67. How about just does their belt lock on to be phased into a different thing? Well, you know, we could always ram them. I'm for ramming, it's not my ship. Yeah, we'll or, do. or, or, we can just run. Right, you ready for this? If we do actually just run, I'm quite happy. We've, we've not left anyone important behind. Well, we left a box that's worth a few thousand, few hundred thousand credits. We have left money behind as well, but we can get more. Yeah, but we're also leaving Lars. Oh, shit, sure. <laughs> yeah, Lars. Yeah. Yeah. I like that. I forgot about Lars. Wasn't there someone else? Something? No, there wasn't. Yeah, Probably a detonator, but no one's gonna press that. <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, there's cards on Facebook, so. Oh, fine. We'll just. Like, basically, could I in some way try and not be boarded and yet have the other ones, uh, have the guys on the Russian ship get a chance to get back onto our ship? Well, you what? So you want to like uh, basically do a circle, circle round in space? <laughs> yeah, like pretty much stay around so they can get. Well, on this is the thing. Around. Like, you're not gonna just stand there and let them board anyway, are you? So no, no, no. Of course not. You, but they're faster than you. They've got bigger guns. There. Can he? Can he do a? Um, you can, can evade combat. Do... Yeah, exactly. This is what I'm thinking. If he does a good enough uh, piloting check, can he do some tricky shit where he? Uh, Starts his engines, goes as fast, fast as he can, and stops. Does he well, like, on the spot the, yeah, and does the. Uh, well, you can't do a U turn, you're in a spaceship. Wow, I'm sorry. But yeah. 180. Do 180. You want to slam the brakes on, get behind them, and blast them yeah, out of like, the sky. Basically, all, do all I can to evade them, but still stay around, stick around so that. Uh, yeah, basically, you need. To, if you have. I'll say if you can avoid. evade combat before they sure, lamprey okay. lock you, then they're going to basically turn around to the bigger threat. Sure. Okay. Oh, I call the Russian ship and ask if we can get any assistance in terms of uh, destroying what's said trying to attach to us as well, just in case. Yeah, well, they're they're kind of got the other patrol boat oh, doing the right. same thing to them. So yeah, they'll they they'll, have guns they'll, they'll they'll try and help you basically. Do we roll initiative for starship combat? Uh, no. I don't think we do, do we? I think basically the actions happen simultaneously. Yeah. Like there's first what we do is we choose what meta dimensional phase we're in, then you show them, then pilots determine whether to attempt a maneuver, uh, then we fire weapons. Then we apply damage. Okay, so we say like zero, one, zero, one, no. Yeah. Or whatever, whatever the uh, meta. So they can go zero, one, two, and you can go zero, one. Yeah. Okay, cool. So, like, just tell me when you want me to post the one I want to be in. One, zero is the real world, right? Um, yes. No, okay. zero, yeah, zero is, yeah. Okay. So, zero. tell me what you're in. Uh, one. Okay, they're in zero. Um, they're firing into zero as well. We forgot, you've yeah. got to do that. You've got to do yeah. what you're moving in and what you're firing into. Yeah, and so, rolling, what is it, rolling 1d6? Uh, to do that, uh, like to see if you, you can still hit, like even if you're firing into the wrong phase. But yeah. You, you need to roll what? One d six. Yeah, and if you get a one, I think it misses. Uh, Nick, no. Well, I uh, think Jordan actually needs to roll that because he's on the guns. Yeah, exactly. But uh, I think what. So I'm already attempting man the man waiver. So yeah. So you need to do. Um, yeah, you need Dex. to do pilot tests. Yeah. So pilot skill plus dex, or is it intelligence? No, it's intelligence. Ow. What if say modifier? Boom. Okay. Oh yeah, and it's also plus the speed of the craft, so that's actually a fourteen. Yeah. Oh god. 
slash r. <coughs> Okay. Fuck you! <laughs> oh, by the way, I'm quite good at rolling sometimes. Yeah, when you actually type slash r. Yeah. Yeah. I'm even better when I don't type slash r. Yeah. Okay. So you do not evade combat. Yeah. Well, you need. To, I need to successfully evade them twice to actually evade. I think it's actually evade, evade combat. I think it's actually equal to twice the other pilots. Yeah. So it is twice. Yeah, okay. Um, Jordan, do you want to fire? Yeah. What am I rolling? Well, first you need to decide which meta dimensional phase you're firing into. One. Okay, they're in zero. <laughs> yeah, are you ready? <laughs> oh, God. Well, technically, no that would be meta gaming because you. Yeah, know, yeah, I know. But that would, we would have. Sorry. Yeah, so that's uh, 2D6. No, uh, D20. And the, no, here it is. Here's the text on uh, how the firing each other thing works. Oh, what? Mm -hmm. So first roll a 1d6. But, and it has to be above zero. Above one, I mean. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I think that's what I said. So yeah, Jordan. Um, D20... Plus your int, plus your or minus your gunnery skill. Uh, aren't gunnery just dex? Say that again. Aren't gunnery dex weapon? Yeah. I, I have a plus one in both dex and int, so it doesn't matter. No, no, they're, they're, they're int, yeah. Oh, really? Yeah, everything on a ship is intelligence, basically. Oh, yeah, right, shit is. And I don't have gunnery systems on my side, so it's just fucked in time. Plus, wait there, get, let me get that AC. Plus, uh, yeah. Their AC is are, six. I think there's an inherent bonus to all laser weapons, so. Yeah, that's the plus one. So as well. another plus one on top of that because of the weapon we're using. Nope. Okay. <laughs> Good job you're on the guns then. Uh, what's your AC? Where's oh, fuck it. Our ship AC is six, and our armor is two. Yeah, the things are AP twenty anyway. Yeah, well, I'm just letting you know. Uh... Okay. So they hit you. Jesus. Good session, boys. Good session. <laughs> <laughs> well, they're firing to disable, so it's not the end of the world. Good session, boys. I rolled all the assets in character next session, don't worry. However, they're also firing into a different phase than us, but I don't, you know, it's probably not going to matter. So, you know, 1d6. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, wait, wait for this roll. 17 D4? No. Oh, uh, why am I bad? 100 minus 100 D100. Brilliant. Okay, so you take... Damages? You take 8 damage. Oh, it's half? Yeah, because it's they're firing to disable. Okay. So we are at 12? Oh, sorry, you are at 12. Well, okay. 8 minus 2 for our armor. So, yeah. No, it's AP 20. Yeah, oh, it's okay, no, it's AP10, sorry. Yeah, well, it still pierces all armor. Yeah. So we're down to 12 HP. Okay, cool. <laughs> if we flip back over to the other guys... Yeah. Um, You have basically already been boarded. So, as you're running through the ship towards the airlock, there is, like, fighting ensuing... Or you can hear fighting ensuing. And as you round the corner to the airlock, there is going to be three pirates. Or, or like, non-Russian guys trying to take the box away, basically. Uh, what do we, what do we you, well, you're both going to get a free attack, basically. Okay. 
right. I'm gonna charge him with my sword. He has a bow. Sword is better. Yeah, sword is better. Okay, yeah, so, um... D20 plus 9, because they're surprised, so they don't get their armor. Plus primacy weapon skill plus dex? Yep. Or strength? Uh, plus 1 for attack bonus? Mm, I don't think it has an attack bonus. Yeah, yeah, he does. Warrior. He does for his level. Yeah, I'm a warrior. Oh, right, warriors are stupid. No. Uh, <laughs> guessing exactly. I'm just rolling D20 plus... Ten for my laser weapon. No, uh, uh, all laser weapons have an inherent plus one as well, because you know they're lasers. Yeah, Easy. and um, you've you've got a zero in the skill and plus zero. Um, you don't have the plus one in dex, or do you? Yes, I do. I have fucking sixteen dex, man. That's I have the most dex in this group. You're plus eleven. Yeah. Yeah. I just want to take that back. I I also have sixteen dex. Oh yeah, well we tied that. So you're, you're rolling plus 11. Uh, okay. Oh, okay, that guy eats lasers. Or not. Roll okay, damage. roll damage. 26. So much damage. All of the damage, all of the time. What if I put my notepad on? Where you left it? Under the book. Okay, so four damage to Senor Pirate. Yeah, you wing him like real good, but he he, he falls on his ass, but he's still alive. Okay, and now we need to roll initiative. D8 plus X. Is higher better or worse? Uh, higher is better. Okay. Okay, so Lars first, then the pirates or general enemies, and then Andre. Okay, so 9 plus 3, 12, 12. Uh, it's not plus 9 anymore actually. Because they are not surprised anymore. Well, you know, okay. it doesn't matter. He doesn't hit 20 anyways. Yep. Yeah. Okay. okay, so... Um, the one on the floor is basically going to stand up and pull his gun as his action. The one that you've engaged with a sword... Is going to... Bring out his knife and attack you. Okay. What's your AC? Uh, four. Okay. Very close, but not good enough. Uh, the other one's going to take a shot at Billet. What's your AC? Nine. No, it's mine is your dex, so it's Yeah, whatever. Eight. Oh, so mine would be actually three. Forget about dex. Yeah, yeah. Wait, you have a t you have an eighteen? Yeah. No, no, he one. has a shield. I have a shield. Oh you have a shield, okay. I'm a knight, oh. remember? For a second there, I thought you had a, a 18 in dex. I, got, I had 17, but I know. Oh, okay. So he has high dex in you as well, yeah. Okay, okay. they miss you as well, Billy. Yep. Um, Lars again. Come on. Yeah, nice. Do me some damage. I thought it hit because they have that damage. Nine, right? What is the AC actually? Yeah, what's the actual AC? Five. Well, then I missed. So, yeah, take by four from that. Okay. 
Uh, row D20 plus one. Uh. Keep in mind, as a warrior, you can choose to omit any damage. Yeah. Like, uh, yeah. Uh, also, that should have been plus like another three, but. Yeah, but I need to know what's the damage. I'm just looking at it now. It's like 1d4. Yeah, so. Probably little bit Two. Yeah, sure. You just take it like so, a man? Basically, yes. Um, the other one is gonna do the same. That me? Yeah. They, they've just basically whipped out knives and they're attacking you. Yeah. Uh. I'm fucking. You said okay. you were good at rolling. Nah. I'm kidding. It's rolling perfectly. Uh -huh. oh. Yeah, exactly. I'm... Oh, yeah, yeah. Remember, I don't like killing guys. Well, I know a player that likes to kill people. A very pacifist pirate. <laughs> pacifist pirate, yes. What's that about my rolling? It's like two 20s in four rolls. <laughs> yeah. either, you either roll sub 5 or not 20. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, Ville, that is a hit on you. Oh, you mean you as in Larry? Be late. Be late. Okay. Oh, be Okay. I can live with that. <laughs> <laughs> I can as well. I, I don't. I, maybe he can't. Uh, three damage to you, Vile. Ooh. Technically, yeah. technically, the two things I hate most in the world fight each other right now. <laughs> British and Vile. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care who dies. They can double KO as far as I'm concerned. You know that before he dies, he's gonna take an immediate action to you know, pop the trigger. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, I'm. Go, well, you're like a, thousands of kilometers away, though. Uh, so again, the class is five. Yeah. So you have a plus eight. Twenty-four. Sweet. Nice. Okay. Uh, well. Four. Yeah, that is a kill, I'm pretty sure. Where is he? Yeah. So you've got a sword, right? Yep. Yeah, you just describe your kill, sir. So basically, when he lunges at me with the knife, I bash him in the abdomen with my shield uh, and stab him in the neck with, with a sword and kick him off. Nice. Nice. Slide him off your blade. <laughs> yes. Peasant. Okay, so seeing yeah. this, the other one turns, clearly identifying you as the bigger threat, and fires. Oh. Who actually believes Vila is a threat? I mean, God. You should. Well, that's because he has an unfair advantage. <laughs> Okay, that's so that's seven perfect. damage to you. Okay, I'm gonna skip that. Okay. <laughs> Makes sense. Uh, keep in mind that my AC is three. Yeah, yeah, I know. What's up? Okay. These are good pirates. I guess. I really what's eight? Oh, fuck. Yeah, they're not pirates. <laughs> well, they're, they're oh, like... They're, they're pan stellar. Yeah, the corporate Nazis. Okay, so... Is it my turn yet? Or... No, there's one more guy. Good. How many are there? What the fuck am I doing with a D... You're supposed to roll a D20. Yeah, I know. I don't know, man. D10 with that one. But we can take that, uh, that roll now. Yeah, I okay. I'm fine with allowing you to take that, because it's my error. But I'll just roll that anyway. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, we'll take it. <laughs> I'll just roll bad anyway. Okay, Ville, now it's your shot. So I'm guessing it's not nine anymore? No, their AC is now five. So you have one, plus seven. <laughs> what? <laughs> well, uh, that's probably a hit. You kill all of this shit. Yeah, okay. sweet. Roll damage. 1d6, woo! Come on. 
Your yeah. Shit. Well, no, it's enough to kill though, because he sh he did four damage before. Aww. So yeah, there's one guy's one guy left, Lars. So I say, so it's just you and me, and I attack him. Yes. yes. Nice. Damage. Uh, I nick him. <laughs> well, yeah. Black, I guess. No, no, because they have four health, so that's like okay. quite. Are you applying your strength to that damage, by the way? Nope. Don't you get your strength to damage? Um, With melee weapons? I don't no, think so. Both. I don't think you do. Okay. It's you only use your strength or your dex to calculate the hit. Yeah, it's to hit. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. Yep. Okay, so. Wow. Okay, yeah, so he doesn't run. Oh. <laughs> no, he rolls a natural <laughs> one. Okay. Um, Philae go himself. and then Lars go. He stabs himself. <laughs> he dies. <laughs> Sweet, he's got one health, so he's dead. Yeah, so I walk up to him, I press my laser pistol against his forehead, and I pull the trigger. Okay. There's a massive hole, I'm guessing. Um, not because of it's a laser pistol. It's like a very neat, clean cut hole. Yeah, but it's still like, okay, yeah. whatever. It, it only is the size of the barrel, basically. Okay, fair enough. So I'll have a massive. So I'll have a massive barrel. <laughs> yeah. So I've got a hand cannon, laser yeah, pistol. It's, yeah. Like I said, it's a laser revolver. <laughs> I, what? Can I have a laser blunderbuss? Yeah. It's it's not in the thing, but like. None uh, of you can have anything. Is that unreasonable? I'm, I'm uh. just guessing. Like. It looks the way I want it to look, so if I have a laser revolver or like a laser pistol that what, 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 Okay, but you only get you only get um five so shots or six shots. My then. <laughs> That'd be so fair, like yeah. Okay, so I, I just basically wanted to get that bit out of the way so that we could go to the space combat. So now you I, can I... board Go on. Uh, I was gonna say uh, I just whip out my telekinetic gun. Why not? I don't mind. Yeah, go in the corner. You keep saying that, and then I'll get back to this. Yeah. Tell the <laughs> good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So you're on the ship, just like holding your fingers up in a shape of a gun, like imagining that you've got a gun. And saying telekinetic gun over and over again. No, <laughs> you you've switched the your compad onto playing uh, Wonder Boy by Tenacious D, and you're just there like mind bullets. <laughs> So yeah, um, Ville and Lars, you're both now able to just basically get on the shuttle with the the box and your two briefcases of money. I would, I would frisk the pirate. Frisk the pirate? Yeah. Yeah, um, they've all got semi-auto pistols and a knife. Okay. And that's it. I'm going to take all the semi-auto pistols. So. Okay. So you just spend like a minute just putting all the shit inside your like plate armor or something. Sure. In his mouth, god damn it. <laughs> I actually have a standard I won't go with that. Okay, so yeah. Yeah, so you, you can basically just get on the cargo lifter now and Ville, you have space vehicle zero, right? Uh I can't remember. Might have changed that. You're used to. Yeah, I do. I do. Yeah, so you you can fly this um, cargo lifter, no problem. Okay. Um, now if Is we question, could it fit into our cargo hold through the door thing? Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, it's it's not gonna be easy, but yes. Would it be faster doing that than having them dock and getting the fuck off? Yeah, they're not gonna be able to dock while you're evading combat off this other exactly. ship. So we basically. pretty much have to do it that way. Yeah. I designed it so that you'd get a free cargo lifter, all right? 
Is that fine? Yeah, yeah. Is that yeah, fine yeah, with yeah. everyone? That's yeah. fine. <laughs> no, I hate you. <laughs> Don't can, give me can, free can stuff. Like, can I just say what you just said? Um, they can land in it. I'm like, yeah, free ship. Yeah. <laughs> you just like air fist pump to yourself yeah. with your yeah, other yeah, hand still as a gun. gun. <laughs> okay, so basically you're going to get it's going to be a couple of rounds until they get to you in the ship. Can I manoeuvre to uh, like try and intercept with them? Yeah, I, I'm calculating that in, basically. Okay, sure. So I'm assuming you're trying to evade combat and like yep, circle around. Yeah. So give Jesus. me pilot. Yeah, and I'll include the plus fucking speed thing now as well, so we don't have to do stupid shit. Uh, Time to evade combat. Plus two plus that, so that's plus. No, not two. Yeah, decent. Oh fuck me! I need to. I need to like sit here and practice these rolls because I never use rolls twenty. Okay, so they, that's equal. Oh god. Uh, yes. Defender I, win, or do you want us to roll again? I'm gonna say that that's probably defender win, right? Because that's only what makes sense. I told you guys how much I love my GM. That basically means. So that would basically mean nothing. Or I don't know. I don't. Yeah, like nil. It's not isn't a success, it, basically. Isn't it usually, though, like on everything, that uh, whoever is rolling wins. Well, we're both rolling. Both rolling? Okay, well then, yeah. that's fine. Uh, what, what, he, what he means is uh, whoever's rolling to beat the other one. Uh, if. Uh... Yeah, like let's say somebody has an AC of something and then, you know, it's equal to that number, it means that the guy who rolled something wins. Well, I think this would No, but he has to make successful. So it's an opposed check. Yeah, yeah. yeah and he yeah, has to make successful. So he has yeah, to get yeah. higher than the other guy, basically. Yeah, yeah then, then it's. The status quo. Under, I guess, or something. I don't know. Or isn't evade like you have to be you a big make, or great. You have to make two successes, <laughs> basically. I have to beat his pilot roll twice. Wait, and so then basically, what just away. happened is he completely telegraphed what you're going to do, but he didn't gain any ground or lose any. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. So but you don't. You don't. Part. Lose any anyway, really? Mm, brilliant. So status quo. Yeah. So you've got. I'm gonna make a note of how many more turns until they basically catch up. Three. All of them. <laughs> All of the turns. Yeah. So um. Give me what Jordan. Give me what. Phase you're shooting into, and Freed, give me what phase you're flying in. Zero. Real speed. Yep. Okay, everyone's in zero. Across oh, the shit. board. So mine was good. Yours was shit. Good job. <laughs> yeah. I was thinking they were going to fire into uh, meta phase one. Um, so, Elise, give me a an attack roll. What am I rolling? I haven't rolled anything D20. yet. Just D20, that's but it. But D20, because, you know, we have no... No, D20 plus one. Plus one, because it's a laser AC. weapon. And plus their plus AC. Plus their AC, oh. which is... Four, I believe? Or was it five? It's six. No, because plus, so plus seven. So I get plus seven. Ooh. plus seven. Okay. Uh, so they've got plus one, plus two. So I miss. Brilliant. Yeah. And what's your AC? I have no idea. It's like five, three, two, one. Six as well. Six. Do anyway. it. That's what I said. <laughs> That's what I said, Mom. Shut up. <laughs> okay, so they. Yes. Their guns explode. Yeah, their gun explodes and everyone wins. Yes. Um, Give me a pilot check. Woo! <laughs> I'm gonna re-roll that. Yeah. Fuck um, yes! Nice. Yes, yes, ex yes, expert, rolling an 8 to a 16. <laughs> yep, so that's one success. Fuck you. Um, uh, one out of two. Indiscriminate amount of rounds till they catch you. Give me meta-dimensional phases. Yeah, I'm see one as well. Okay, well they're in zero and firing into zero. Fuck yeah. Oh, so damn it, GM. 
I see a pattern emerging. Yeah. I'm gonna fire into one next time just because. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Jordan, give me a. E6. Well, you need to hit first, I think. No, it's yep, the other way around. E6 first. Why D6? It's roll. Because you need to roll over a one. Oh, fuck you. Yep. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna do 20 plus. Am I running D6 to hit? No. D6, then D20 to hit. Yeah, because you rolled meta dimensional phase first and then two hit. Oh, fuck you guys. That's a success. success. Wow. That's a total hit. Words, Shut up. Words are hard. <laughs> fuck me. <sighs> You're keeping it being a failure. No, I won't. <laughs> you wish. Oh my god, you fucking wanker. I hate you so much. <laughs> god damn it. <laughs> okay, so six more damage. Six damages. We're on like what two? We're on six. We're on six. That's what I said. Okay, meta-dimensional phases. <laughs> <laughs> they are, they are in one, firing into zero. Oh fuck it! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Brilliant. Yeah. So this is my yeah pilot check. That's pissy. Come on, double that one from DM. Double that one from DM. Come on. Come on. Sure. Success. Yes! Fuck you! <laughs> Is a one and a two good enough for you? Yeah, you mm -hmm. lose. Okay, so yeah. you evade combat. You lucky motherfucker. So I'm no, I'm not lucky, I'm skillful. So I've gone uh... fine the face, To be fair, you did use your um, reroll at a critical point and it worked. Yeah. So uh, you just want to so win the so. universe. You guys love me too much. That's very good. <laughs> How much damage? <laughs> it's like a 1d4. <laughs> <laughs> and How it has... What's his other piercing? Uh, it's our AP 20, I think. No, wait, what? I think you get an ability. No, you don't. It's 1d4. Yeah. It's so crap. Okay, so you, like, disappear from the scanners and then this, like, equivalent of a rock hitting a stone wall just... Pings off their armor. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> wah, wah, wah. But, but hey, we only need to do that like ten more times, and we can totally take them well, out. Well, if you start firing again, they're gonna find. They're gonna just. Yeah, I know. Automatically <laughs> find you. So, um, Elise needs to go at one. So I would say this is probably a good point to stop. Aw. I'm sorry, guys. Work. I can't see. No, it's okay. Well, I mean, um, for future use, I know I split you up there. Is that a bit too, like, we no. basically no. people were set, no, just sat doing nothing for a minute? It's fine. No, 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 it's completely fine. Like I mean, listen as well. If, if yeah, okay. There's so a, I'm just. There's a just, for us to split up, and we chose to split up. Yeah. No I, so I, I, I know this is pretty obvious, but my preparation for that was um, you're going to go on my planet, there's going to be zombies. There's going to be a case, and then there's going to be a space battle afterwards. So it was basically all um, <laughs> improvised. Yeah, now hey, I have. Fun. Fun. You, you pretty much yeah. gave me three million credits. You gave me a free mini fridge. <laughs> mini fridge. <laughs> yeah, but I you got did to be an awesome pilot. Million, you just did give me a million credits for free. Yeah. So, um, mm, any feedback? Your warrior, though, was um, Anyone with any? question just like as right now when we're ending is villa and uh, sorry uh, victor's character are they on our ship now or are we still separate from them hmm. okay so basically because you've evaded their combat i think the the ship is going to be like well fuck these small fry let's take out the frigate and we'll deal with them later yeah and there's no way they're going to stop to worry about a fucking cargo lifter okay so so essentially, uh, uh, we can start the next session. They're either on ship or you pick them up, and that's the end of it. Like, sure. you can, can we just carry roll on. for me to land it there? I don't even think you really need to roll because you're out of combat, so okay. you yeah, can kind of land. just. I wanted to roll, though. You can roll, it's up to you. 
Because can then I, I could have failed. Can I roll to navigate into a good position? Can I roll so my computers grab him? <laughs> you can both roll. At least you can help because computers. Perfect. Um, and we'll add the so score what is, together. What are we doing? What is vehicles? LOL! Yes! So what are we rolling? 2d6 plus What one. is vehicles based on? No, it's... Uh, In, I think. Intelligence or dex. It'd be intelligence because it's you're not actually doing it yourself. You're. <laughs> we win. So fuck that re-rolling. There we go. Much better. Yeah, yeah. Nice Basically, with that fourteen, you he was gonna pick up any of your slack anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking, this is how it's done. Uh, Fun. <laughs> yeah. I am the most professional. So okay. Call this vehicle for putting on the character sheet purposes. The it, sh it is shuttle? it is a cargo lifter. It's it's a ship um, so upgrade. A cargo shuttle? It's called a cargo lift lighter. Oh. It's like an actual upgrade in the book Ooh. for your ship. Oh. oh, but it has a mass of two, so we'd... would that just mean we have like... You're going to lose some of your cargo space, essentially. Okay, sure. Two, what the hell is a cargo lighter? It's it just transport. I'm, so it's, what it's I'm imagining is... It's a, it's a hovering forklift. No, it's like... A... <laughs> I'm imagining the shuttles in Star Wars that they, they used to go between... Uh, Star Destroyers. Like the Imperial Shuttle? Yeah, with the three wings. That's what I'm imagining. Hey, you're, you're the SM. We'll yeah, follow I mean, something like that, yeah. basically. Although, you know, the or, wings... Or we'll just have, you know, a hovering forklift. Yeah, but you've already got a hovering forklift. Yeah. <laughs> like, this is a we space... Do? Yeah, yeah you're, you've got a you've got a hover um, cargo loader and three grav bikes. Oh, shit. That's so, cool. we, like, we have a grav lifter and two hover cycles. So, pretty much... Now we need a ship that has uh, what the fuck is the corridors thing? wide enough so I can just ride around with the uh, fucking hovering forklift. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I, I agree. Man, it's the it's the greatest idea of all time.